<laughs> I click baited you. Kinda. Do when we go out and do things. Walking left. Found your wings in the sky tonight. I'm sitting on the rock and watch the heron fly. Feet in the water, I'll away. I would like to show you my shoes that I thrifted because they're magical. It's been such I'm crying on the internet again. Literally someone just commented that they're from Iraq. And I had someone the other day say they were from India. I don't know. <laughs> it's just crazy that people from like around the world are like watching. <laughs> this is embarrassing. There's no way that this is gonna go anywhere. I'm just gonna like leave it on my phone forever and I'll never watch it again. Unless. <laughs> Why am I like this? Is it because I'm a water, sun, and moon side? Okay, bye. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I essentially have a bunch of chores that I need to do, so I figured I'd record them. They're not really chores. They're- I don't know what they are. Also, I'm not- I'm not stringing along my sentences very coherently. So this is essentially what I need to do. There's a few other things I want to do, but I didn't want to overwhelm myself, so I have those on a different list in case I get everything done and I have more time. My room is messy because I'm a human and I'm not going to apologize for it. That's the hill I'm dying on today. Is my audio good? I can't see. Ah! Ah! Here are a bunch of really old shirts, like really old. Like I got a 21 Pilots shirt, this shirt from high school. No, no. Destroyed. Old work shirt, old basketball shirts that are disgusting and there's like no way I can donate them. I'm gonna cut them into rags that I can use to clean and wash and reuse because I think this is good for the world maybe i don't know this might actually be bad because who knows what's good or not i'm gonna cut it and they're gonna be like the micro shit is falling everywhere you're destroying the planet Ugh. i got a comment the other day that shook me to my fucking core and i want to talk about it for a second i was talking about my astrology and she literally said like I can't believe that your two water signs, your moon and sun are both water signs. Like you have to be, like what's your rising? You have to be a fire sign. I don't know shit about anything. Okay, let's get that clear. For anything in general, but horoscopes especially. Although I wish I did. I wish I did know things, but I don't. And that's how the world works sometimes. <laughs> and this girl, she knew a lot, all right? Because I looked up my natal chart again and I am a Sagittarius rising. Oh my God, God. maybe she's born with it. Maybe it's me, a fire sign, oh wow, amazing personality, wow. A fire sign. I saw God that day and I'm still scared. <laughs> First of all, how dare you perceive me? And second of all, I read about my rising sign and I felt like my brain was being tickled. I haven't come to the conclusion if I like the way that feels yet, but just know I'm uncomfortable. But yeah, I was shook. I was shook. She was right. She was right. Um, and I fear her. In, and I mean that in the nicest way possible. I'm scared of you. Can you see my feet? If you can, I'm gonna censor him. You ain't getting these for free. Get off this video, Quentin Tarantino. Okay, I need to stop. Okay, so I've gotten to a point with only one shirt where I stopped caring. And I think I need to start caring again because these are kind of ugly and I do want to use them. But do they need to be pretty? Hmm. Does it actually make them more functional to be this square shape? Is the most functional towel the shape of a rectangle? Today we make non-square or rectangle towels. I'm a revolutionary, what can I say? Oh my God, this is taking so much longer. Like this has only been one shirt and I'm already tired of doing this. It's like you commit to these projects, you hold on to these materials so that you could potentially do these projects and suddenly you have like seven projects, all small, but just like mundane. You're like, I don't wanna do this. You've already taken on that task. It's been sitting in your house for so long. 
You have to do it now. Two thousand years late. I'm finally done. I'm going to fix this pot now that I got from the thrift store forever ago that broke. Heartbreaking. Why is this sound so violent? It's like a puzzle. I'm a human clamp right now. I cannot move or do anything. Fuck. No! 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 Ow! I cut myself. I'm covered in super glue right now. There's no way. Is this a lost cause? Is this a fucking lost cause? Did I just do all this for nothing? Okay, I'm just gonna have to do it all at one time. Oh my god. Oh, the fumes. Okay. If this doesn't work, then it doesn't work and I give up. Fixed it. Yay. Document it. Day one, list halfway done. It's a different day and I'm wearing the same sweater. Also today I'm wearing my 2012 uh, Skins English boy fantasy and also blue middle school girl fantasy. Yeah, those words should not be strung together in a sentence like that. I'll try again. My, you know what? Today we're doing the cigarette holder, which I'm scared of, because if I mess it up, I am screwed forever for the rest of my life. What is going on with my hair? Oh my God. I'm not an anime character. That has to stop. That has to stop. Whatever. I got my cloth, gloves, the thing I'm gonna do, whatever this cleaner is, and a bucket of water. Sprinkle onto a wet surface, gently rub with a cloth, rinse thoroughly with clean water within a minute of application. Within a minute, oh my god, scary. Okay, you have to test it first though. Whoa, cleaning it like super nicely. Here's the before before after <laughs> all right check and check i did do this but i did not film it Sorry, but were you here for art videos? Because apparently I don't do those anymore, so. Sorry. If you're here for art videos, um, I apologize. Casually losing all interest in everything that once brought me joy. Here are some doodles to make up for it. it look intentional by adding other stuff that matches a little bit and then boom who fucking cares if you fucked it up it's all better now just have fun you know what patricia maybe maybe it's good for you when you practice what you preach 
Honestly, I have not drawn in so long and I was struggling. I've been hard struggling to do anything, to be honest, to make videos, to make art. I've quite literally lost interest in everything I once enjoyed. Kinda goofy, but who cares? It's been hard. I feel like such a failure, like my channel is finally growing and I don't have any motivation to make any videos. And I honestly have nothing to complain about. Like everything in my life is good. All my basic needs are met. I've been eating healthy. I've been trying to exercise more. I've been taking all the steps to try and make myself feel better. And honestly, because I feel like I have to post a video, I just make videos about how I'm feeling. So yeah, if the last two videos weren't your cup of tea, I'm very sorry. But also, there's nothing I can do. Ha <laughs> ha sorry. We have no healthcare in America. Go to therapy, what therapy? $200 a week therapy? Who can do that? No one. Essentially, American healthcare is just, sorry, you're going through this. Um, here's a pillow. You can scream into it if you want to. Cheers. <laughs> and I promise I will make art videos again one day. Maybe even art that is good. Who knows? The bar is low and the opportunities are endless. I built up this big border in my head, just a huge wall stopping me from being able to draw anything, let alone draw something on camera. I can't draw for fun because I need to get a video done, I can't draw for a video because it has to be good, just all these pressures stopping me from doing what I needed to do. And the pressures only come from myself. Literally, they only come from myself. I posted a video last week saying I was sad, and that's what I did, because I can do that, because it's my channel. This video, I'm posting whatever this is, and I can do that, because this is my channel. It's just hard to motivate yourself, A, but also try to be the best version of yourself all the time. Because the act of the fatter is that no one is perfect, people are humans, and we just gotta be nicer to ourselves, all right? Just be nicer to yourself. The past month, I've been wanting to abandon my life and live in the woods on a mountain, never to be seen again by anyone. Um, obviously, I'm not gonna do that yet. I love my life and I love art and I love making videos and I love my job. It's mental illness, isn't it? I cut my hair, so I'm better now, I think. That's how that works. All the tasks at hand have been finished. Clean these sentimental items. Finish this flower art. Finally drew something again for the first time in forever. Fix this vase that is now holding my trash can. Turn rags from riches that I use in the kitchen daily. Got a flashlight in hopes to use it as a fake spotlight. Had a little too much fun with said flashlight. And that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, and if you didn't and you're never gonna watch me again, um, how dare you? <gasps> After everything we've been through! I'll see you guys next time. Bye!